Have you ever wondered what excise tax is and how it's calculated and how it impacts the money you will actually take home when selling your property? Let's explore everything you need to know to be fully prepared. your local real estate expert and I'm here today diving into topics that are incredibly important for anyone looking to sell their property excise tax it's a term you might have heard before but what does it really mean and how does it affect your real estate transaction well I am here to talk about it and whether you're selling your first home or you're a seasoned property owner understanding excise tax is crucial to ensuring you know exactly what to expect when it comes to your bottom line. So let's break it down. What is excise tax? Excise tax is essentially a transactional tax that you as the seller pay when you sell a piece of your real estate. Think of it as a fee to the state and local governments for the privilege of selling your property. It is calculated as a percentage of your property sales price and it is deducted from your total proceeds at closing so directly impacts how much money you will have in your pocket when all is said and done it is one of those hidden costs that come sometimes taking sellers by surprise if they're not prepared so it is essential to understand how it works in Washington state, there is a base excise tax rate that applies to every real estate transaction. The state rate varies depending on the sales price of your property. And here's a quick breakdown. For property selling for $525,000 or less, the state excise tax rate is 1.1%. For property selling between $525,000 and $1,525,000, these rates increases by 1.28%. From property selling between $1,525,000 and $3,000,000, the rate jumps 2.75%. And for properties that are selling more than $3,000,000, the highest rates applies, which is 3%. This base rate is just the starting point, but it's important to remember that the total excise tax you pay could be higher due to additional local taxes. So in addition to the state-based rate, local governments, meaning the city or the county where the property is located, can impose their own excise tax on top of the state rate. These local rates can range anywhere from 0% to 2%, depending where you live. This means that your total excise tax you could pay could vary based on your location. So for example, if you're living in a city with a 2% local excise tax, that 1.1% state rate could effectually become 3.1%. It is crucial to check your city-specific rates to avoid any surprises. I hope this detailed breakdown of the excise tax has been helpful and that you now have a clear understanding of how it works and how it impacts your real estate transaction. And if you found this video useful, please make sure to give a thumbs up, to share with someone that is looking for, and then also don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more real estate tips and insight. And for now, I'm so grateful you're here today. Thank you so much for watching. And if you have any questions or you need any personalized advice, make sure to reach out to me.